la 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 What's going on guys? This is Theo to the Future and we're here going to do another reaction video. We're doing it to another Jubilee video. You guys know this channel. They're all about understanding em the empathy of human good and uh, <laughs> their videos are funny, all right? I don't know why I'm talking like this, okay? I don't know what I'm doing, all right? We're watching, <laughs> the one we're watching today is called <laughs> Speed dating 10 comedians based on their jokes. So it's this girl, and I guess she's going through 10 comedians. I guess, uh, I think they're guys. Maybe they're guys and girls, I don't know. But uh, they're gonna see, we're gonna see if they're funny. I, I wanted to watch this one because, you know, I like to laugh. Ah, you got me, I like to laugh. Uh, and uh, I wanted to see if these guys can make me laugh. So right now they're going on a date with me. They're gonna be trying to win my love. And, uh, yeah, let's see if they can do that. Let's see if they can, uh, can accomplish that. First time I ever did a uh, stand-up comedy, uh, sitting down. <laughs> Hopefully it's not the first laugh you, uh, get. <laughs> My name's Harper Rose, and I'm a comedian. Did you ever date a comedian before? No, but I have made out with some. The last guy that I dated was unlike any other guy I've ever dated before because I'm about 5'7 and this guy was really addicted to cocaine. Oh. So. <laughs> I definitely think so because it's such an intimate art form. And I think like when you're being that vulnerable, that opens you up to being vulnerable to other things. Are you ready to laugh? Truth. <laughs> I agree. She got me. She made me laugh. <laughs> I'm gonna die. I'm not over shape. I'm like out of weight. Ugh. I'm not out of, uh, Is this the remix? out of shape yet. Uh, but I'm one good burger away from it. So Ugh. if you did, if you could see me, uh, you would be laughing. That's a great joke. Uh, it usually gets bad <laughs> jokes. No, that you can't see me, but I, I, I'm, I have a little trouble with my identity currently because I, I got the results of a DNA test and uh, found out I was 60% white. Now uh, it's weird because now I got all these like white symptoms kicking up inside of me. Uh, like the other day, I was sitting like, you know what? I think I'm. You should. You should go back back in here. Gonna buy a ticket to Europe. I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. <laughs> tell by your tone that you're not um <laughs> would you say pineapple belongs on pizza no well i guess we can't get them all we can't win them all i love pineapple on pizza no ew gross that's gross she, she touched my belly and then she was like you're fat are you pregnant which is just it hurt but i can't go to the gym be bench pressing at the gym just like yeah screw you amy yeah that's what you get amy people are gonna be like who's amy is she the girl that broke your heart you're like no this third grader that made me feel small like that's not <laughs> i'm on the dating apps and i noticed a lot of girls write the same thing on all their profiles which is uh no hookups no hookups and it really baffles me you tell me there's no girl out there that wants a sweet deal on a stereo even though my friend bob works at best buy <laughs> <laughs> they don't really hook that up for you. Just keep <laughs> <it>. <laughs> is reversed. Because what's one smell that rich people can't stand that poor people gotta get used to? It's pee, man. It's on the it's on the subway, it's downtown. You don't you hate that when you have some actors, some actress, you really respect, you really like <laughs> Where are you from? Oh, I'm from North Carolina. North Carolina. <laughs> oh man, this guy's killing them. This guy is killing them. Oh my god. Oh, okay. Um, I'm so sorry, but Lou, because it sounds like Lou's gonna be No! 
<laughs> no. <laughs> the P guy. The P guy is hilarious. David, I like British people, so it seems like we're just not gonna hit it off. <laughs> Justin, I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh, it didn't feel too good. I mean, when it comes down to being eliminated, pretty much just lets a person know that you, you know, you ugly, but they haven't, <laughs> you know, seen your face. I'm so, I'm so sorry, but I just... I... <laughs> Man, these are the two hottest guys. Yeah, that's the second best looking guy. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I love co comedians. <laughs> <laughs> that guy's funny. Oh my god, me either, honey. Oh, I love it. And then also, people that always have bad breath. That's something that. Was that funny? Oh, you accept. Yeah. I always keep Listerine strips on me at all times. That was a lie. I'm sorry. I don't want to start this relationship off with lies. I'm a very silly person, so I like girls who do bits. Who kind of like it's a ping pong match. Mm -hmm. Like maybe we start making inside jokes in the first date, and then by the third date, we might be saying crazy stuff like "That's what the old Jackrabbit said." You know? <laughs> <laughs> Dang. Okay. <laughs> that guy's funny. <laughs> yeah, there was no connection there. Wild card read. <laughs> yeah, there was no spark there. Probably the guy with the glasses is gone. Be like the bachelor for ABC now. So 2028, the bachelor. Oh, that guy seemed funny though. Yet again, why did you start comedy? I started comedy because I was telling everybody else to chase their dreams except for myself. I usually have these epiphanies that, and I look at my hands. And I realized it's me, and I went for it and chased my dream to be a comedian. What about you? What's your goals? Good stuff. Um, Good I stuff. I to get representation across the board, and then um, I would love to do a late night set. Set? Wait, so you're a comedian? I am a comedian. Wow. Oh, I know. <gasps> love at first oh. curtain. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be there at those open mics with you, honey. Oh, well, I can't oh. wait. You stole my heart. All right. Oh, uh, cute. And I'm going to let you talk to these strangers. <laughs> 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 We have something. I feel it. <laughs> He's good. He's good. Oh, we have the same dream. <laughs> that is crazy. We have Look the at the dream. stars are aligned. Do you have any like quirky spots that you don't like, like bowling? Honestly, yeah, I think you nailed it with the bowling. I broke my finger on a first date one time bowling. Oof. And so it just really triggers the, the bad memories. We won't even watch the Big Lebowski, okay? Like, <laughs> bowling is out. Is that guy just wearing... They're all very lovely. Oh, they're all just wearing socks? Um, <laughs> Yo, that first guy. You know what? I'm a sucker for the keys. I was wooed by Tommy. <laughs> oh, no way. <laughs> Ooh, the keys, boy. That music. That music. <laughs> he did so well. I think he did well. Look at LeBron James. He loses more finals than he has won. <laughs> he decided to pick that guy's a cool cat. Piano guy? It's the music. Comics. Who brings pianos to a comic? I... <laughs> I'm frustrated. That's what I am. I feel him. I feel him. <laughs> I feel him. Nice, nice. These are Walmart socks. I was not aware. Why are they in their socks? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, she in socks too? I thought she was in like heels. Thank you. I do think I made the right choice. I do think I made the right choice. Oh, so did I. Yeah. <laughs> I was like looking at all these guys. So I'm like definitely hurt. <laughs> yeah. Would you go on the date with them? I would. Yeah. All right. All right. <laughs> 
too ill. <laughs> He's nervous. <laughs> this is a big time date. <laughs> Ooh. Big date, you know? <laughs> Can't wait to call my mom. <laughs> <laughs> so funny man that was great that was great oh uh, i understand what the dude the dude was saying like the black dude with the like the blonde in his hair like i get what he was saying because that music stuff in comedy it's kind of cheesy but yeah you can make it work you can make it work like Bo Burnham, for instance, that guy's a genius. And he started out with music, right? She was loving the music. She, she was giggling like a little schoolgirl, like a, like that high pitch. <laughs> All right, let's read some comments. Let's see, let's see what happens here. Let's see what, let's see what the people have to say, huh? The terrible jokes and, and silent alone. Silence alone was hilarious. I agree. I agree. In the beginning, that's what kicked it off for me. The bad jokes. Because bad jokes are hilarious. Bad jokes are hilarious. That's why comedians love me when I go to their sets. Because, <laughs> you know, I laugh regardless. Bruh, they were all funnier after getting eliminated. <laughs> that's true. That's true. Who knows? Maybe we didn't see like, um... Some of their funnier moments with her. I don't know. Editing, you know? Didn't think I was going to laugh. Then that dude got eliminated and said, Felt good to be picked first for something. <laughs> I think I missed that. Was that Lou? I missed Lou. Lou made me laugh with the pee. The pee stuff, man. The pee stuff was golden. <laughs> I love how most of the guys got her to laugh at least a little bit. And then there's that one guy sitting there talking about P. He was the funniest. Lou wasn't there to get a girlfriend. He was there to make his stance on P known. <laughs> yes, he has a cause, a cause, a cause for P. Oh my God. Lou is another word for toilet. <laughs> Coincidence? I think not. I think not too. I think not too. No, there's, there's a clear, uh, problem with this video and it is that Lou was not picked I I agree with myself and everybody on here agrees with me from what I see so uh, I don't know what that girl's problem was but I do hope it worked out for her and the piano man because piano man was funny as heck too I love comedians I love comedians they're so funny and real you know they know how to most of them anyway the good ones, anyway, know how to, like, talk about anything and just make it funny. And they don't take anything seriously, and I think that's really cool. And I think you guys are cool, too. And I'm glad you watched this video. It's over now. Good job making it to the end. Uh, until next time, maybe we'll do some more Jubilee videos or something like that, you know? But until then, please consider dropping a like, a comment, a sub, a share. Especially if you like what's going on here, you know what it is. This is Theo to the Future. G-G!